I'm sorry that this meeting is necessary, Mrs. Grimshaw. Yeah, so am I, because uh, Todd's done an out wrong. So you say. That's right, I'm his mum and I should know. I'm afraid the evidence suggests otherwise. What evidence? Todd's been writing things about me on the board. And how do you know that it was him? You've got no proof. No one saw me do anything. Who else could it be? Oh, is this about him seeing you legless? I wasn't. Well, it wouldn't be the first time, would it? I mean, what about our party a while back? Your husband practically had to carry you home. I'm sorry. Mrs Grimshaw, we're here to discuss Todd's behaviour on school premises, not Mrs Ramsden's in her own private time. Yeah, well, one's pretty much to do with the other, if you ask me. No, it isn't. You are. Well, it don't matter how else she gets. I never wrote nothing about it on the board. So who was it, then? I don't know. Oh. What is this? My lad's innocent until proven guilty. You're a head teacher, not the head of the flaming KGB. Mrs Grimshaw, if you can't be civil to my staff... You'll do what? Give me the cane? Yeah, well, I'd really love to see you try. Are you threatening me? No more than you are threatening my lad with something he didn't do. Well, that'd be right. They never listen to what you've got to say at this place. Teachers are always right, and kids are only there to get in the way. That's nonsense. You know very well how proud we are of pupils' achievements at this school. That's rubbish. All they do is make you look good. That's why they're in here, and that's all you care about. Todd! I've had enough of it. And I've had enough of you. You're excluded. Oh, what? For just knocking a few lousy tin cups off the shelf? He's out of control. Yeah, and I don't blame him. I'd be angry if I had to pull up with you. And that's enough, Mrs Grimshaw. I'm not listening to any more of this. You're banned from the school, too. You can see where he gets it from. It's such a shame. Because Todd's such a bright boy. But he doesn't stand a chance with a mother like that. She's certainly forthright. Can't be easy for you living on the same street. Across the road, in fact. Maybe a little more discretion on your part would help things. I'm sorry? You're a teacher, Charlotte. You remain a representative of this school. And hopefully a role model to its pupils. What are you saying, Miss Johnson? I expect our students to behave out of school, but I'm prepared if sometimes they don't. I don't extend the same leniency to my staff. But I haven't done anything. If you must get drunk, do so behind your own door and stay there. And if you've got a problem, please find some help. A problem? I don't have a problem. I'm glad to hear it. Thank you, Charlotte. 